know what? Take practicality and throw it out the window. The performance shop will tweak your ride to get the most horses and torque you need. track has specific layouts to really push your car. Tweak your suspension and jimmy the output before you hit the clay so you have the proper setup for the track. Throw your ride on the dyno and run it on the test track to make sure it's wired tight. like this. Suspension controls how your ride reacts to changes in terrain and sideways forces like cornering. The suspension components work like a team and must be tuned together for them to work properly. A general tuning guideline is to adjust your sway bars, then your shocks, followed by your springs. Competition's gonna be coming at you strong, so you're gonna want to adjust your acceleration and top speed. Modify your tranny's final day. Hey, yo, man, you wanna cut through the air quicker and grip the road tighter, right? The faster you go, the more front and rear downforce will be created. That downforce of air equals more grip, because your ride's getting pushed down onto the road. Yeah, you heard it right. Try it out and see. The ride's grip and stopping power can be gauged by the quality of your tires and brakes. So the better the rubber, the more performance you'll get when bending them curves. Now when it comes to brakes, they not only allow you to stop quicker, but they also help in handling when you're cutting through them corners. Yo, listen here. Your electronic control unit regulates air and fuel mixtures to your engine timing. Remapping the ECU gives you the ability to fine-tune engine power at each RPM and squeeze some serious power out of your ride. Know what I'm saying? You're in the right place now, bro. Turbo slam more air into your engine. More air equals more power. So get crazy and adjust the power at each RPM. I told you, this is getting big, yo. Nitrous oxide. We're going B-I-G big. This year bottled up nitrous gas gives your ride a temporary boost of power. Thank mm -hmm. you.